Hello, this is Newton doing a technical analysis of Forex Live on DJI Dow Jones Industrial Average Index. We have an interesting situation here, bulls uh, fighting the bears. Uh, it seems from the opening gap that bulls have a bit of the upper hand, but it might be temporary. We had uh, one touch point, second touch point, third one on this lower band. We've got this one, this, and this on the upper uh, up band. And uh, we have also this triangle with the blue line at the bottom and the red one at the top. Uh, before we had a bounce that goes up to here, which is the middle of that uh, channel. And now we'll have to see if there's going to be another visit to this bottom band uh, and a breakdown, possibly a retest and then more down, then uh, this larger channel is also a bear flag, which won't be good news. On the other hand, if especially uh, now or very close to now around uh, 38,800, that is why uh, please do follow this number. And I think that if we close above it today, then the bulls are good to uh, keep on going higher all the way to 39,500, not necessarily straight away and even more. On the other hand, uh, below 38,800, I would be uh, looking to, uh, first of all, stop my long if I'm in long and then wait and watch. And then look at the area of 38,670. Uh, as I mentioned, that might be the uh, bearish case at this junction. Okay. So this whole area is a junction over here uh, in a way. Um, yeah. But on the other hand, once you understand where we're going, you've got a, a, a bigger upside on the long as mentioned. And on the short, I mean, we have to clear this area as well, the 38. 1575 area um but we, and we might escalate here a bit but if we break down then again we've got this entire uh we've got this entire bear flag excuse my my lines <laughs> uh and uh we've got a big potential down for uh the bears in that case okay so in summary a close above 38800 for the bulls, a close below 38,675 is for the bears and trade at your own risk to return to Forex Live for additional perspective.